Hey everyone. Yes, that is me with my camera in my hand and I'm filming a video. I felt a bit bad about not filming them really because the kids love watching them back and I don't know why I've neglected it really. I guess I've kind of fallen out of love with vlogging a little bit. So I'm hoping that I can try and um, get my mojo back with it because like I said, I feel bad that the kids like to watch these back and in a few years time, I'm hoping that they can still be watching them back and I'll still be doing it. But you know, I've been vlogging for a long time now, haven't I? So, it's Bobby's birthday next month, 17th of March, and we organised, we've organised him a party at Nerf Wars, but we're really, really stuck on what it is we're actually going to get him for his birthday. He wants a snake. Get him a snake. No, I'm not getting him a snake. Why? Who's going to be cleaning the snake out and like looking after it all the time? Well, he, he can. That would be me. We were going to get him a gerbil, actually. That was another option. But then I remembered when Holly and Emily had gerbils when they were younger, I, I kind of was a little bit allergic to him. So that's maybe not a good idea. I don't know whether I still am. It may, might have been because I was pregnant. But we, we're really, really stuck on what to get him for his birthday. He's going to be nine. What do you get a nine-year-old who's really only interested in... Playstations and football. We could get him toys, but let's face it, I don't think he's going to even play with them, to be fair. What do you think? Mm, no, he's got a phone, he's got tablets, he's got a PS4. We don't know what to get footballs. him. Help! <laughs> We've got like millions of footballs in the garden. But yeah, anyway, I'll stop rattling on. Um, when I go to work in a minute, because it's like <sighs> 5 to 11, I'm going to leave at about 10 past. Um, Pack ups. Yes, I've done the pack-ups. They're in the fridge, aren't they? Yeah. Can you get them out for me, please? Yeah, when I go to work, I'm going to hand the camera over to Lee. Let him have a little rant or whatever it is he's doing. I'm doing a lot today. It's, do you know what? I've had a little freak out this morning. I'm 37 next month as well. Like, I'm closer to 40 than I am 30, and I don't feel 37. I feel more like 27. And it's freaking me out how fast time is going and the kids, it makes me just want to cry my eyes out. They're just all growing up so fast. And even my little baby poppy is five now. What's going on? What are you making? What? What are you having? Wheat a mix. Wheat a mix. Uh, green tea, where's green tea? In there somewhere, babe. Just been doing your exercises, haven't you? It's been for a run, yeah. Been for a run. And now he's moaning that he's overdone it. Trying to stand up these bad boys. <laughs> Man boobs. Moves. Moves. <laughs> so this is what Frankie and Bobby have got for their lunch today. They have got some of this wibbly wobbly Partley's jelly, um, a little tangerine, some fridge raiders. What is that down there? One of these mix max chocolate little cake bar thing is and sandwiches in there oh can't even get this one out and an exotic juice drink as well so hopefully that will fill up their little tummies i wasn't even recording then hi too much water too much water it's a green tea you got the key babe it's so bright and sunny it's lovely definitely not typical February weather is it no, the sun is so bright it's like whoa and I think this time last year at this time it was like snowing it was wasn't it beast from the east bye love ya bye love ya come on hurry up come on let's go so that's work done for today Lee's just picked me up and I've just run in the house quick to get my bottle of water um, we need to pop up to Cleethorpe's now um, oh bugger can you just run inside and get something for me? What? My foundation. Oh, yeah, so we're gonna go to Cleethorpe's. Oh, so hot. I need to get some new foundations. I'm hoping that the boots in Cleethorpe stocks it. I also need to go and pay off a deposit for Bobby's birthday party. And I think we're gonna grab a coffee and I need something to eat. I'm starving. I'm sure there's something else that we need to do as well, but can you remember what it is? Um, we need to get some invitations. Okay. Some party invitations. Can for you can do, yeah. Uh, 
I honestly cannot believe how nice and warm it is for February. It's just not right at all. I've seen butterflies and all sorts and all the flowers around the park are all out as well. It's lovely, but I bet you it's going to get cold again soon. So that's the deposit paid off for this party. Can you see the sea out that window? I don't know if you can see it. It's really, really bright. Um, what are we doing next then? Uh, Mr. Allerton needs some food and Bobby's requested spaghetti bolognese for tea which is what I'm gonna do I think oh, I want to sit outside in the sunshine oh, it's nice. made me feel about a million times like better do you know what I mean it was really busy up Cleethorpes and we just couldn't get hot so We've been to town, um, I've got some foundation that I needed and then <clears throat> we've been to Greg's and I'm having a Mexican um, chicken baguette or something like that. He's got some goujons. I'm going to eat this in the car and try and get to Aldi before we have to pick the kids up from school. So we didn't even get time to go in Aldi. <laughs> Lee's just gone and got to get the kids from school. Um, yeah, I wanted to show you in the car actually what the foundation is that I use. I, I, love, I do really love it, the coverage is so good, um, but I never got around to showing yet, so I'll show you now. I use number seven, the Beautifully Matte Foundation, um, and I find it really, really good actually. I have no clue what we're going to do when the kids get back from school, it'd be a shame to spend the after school time stuck in the house, especially while the sun's shining on the outside, so maybe, I'm not too sure just yet, but maybe we're going to take them for an ice cream after school which i think that they're gonna absolutely love it look who's back bobbles out already we've come to cleethorpes again haven't we yeah. and we're gonna get a ice cream, ice cream. yay the ice. first ice cream in cleethorpes of 2019 yeah, and, it's yay. and it's pancake day tomorrow no it's not it's, it's pancake it's day in march Oh. Next week, isn't it? oh. In seven next, days. This day next week. Oh, why over there? She's, <laughs> she's eating the sauce out of the hot dog. <laughs> I eat the ice cream. <gasps> And there we were thinking it'd be lovely and warm up Cleethorpes. It's freezing. Poppy's not bothered though, are you Pops? She's got a coat off and everything. Ice cream face. Is it cold? <laughs> Digging for treasure? Yeah. Found any treasure yet, Poppy? Oh, no. Go on then, Pops, get stuck in. That was a very refreshing walk along the beach, wasn't it? Yeah. Wasn't as warm as what it was earlier on? No. No. And I didn't get a... Pause! Pause. <laughs> <laughs> Unpause. Oh, finally. Thank you. Hey! Oh, are we going to do that tomorrow on the way to school? Don't know when we're going to do it. Yeah, do it. We will see. Oh. 
Were you surprised that I've just done that? Yeah. We are finally home again. It's five o'clock. Isn't it, Frankie? Yeah. Just had to put my hair back because oh. it needs washing and it gets on my nerves. I will okay. take that camera, please. Um, Get some of those big time when it needs a wash. My school has been very good. Very good. But the one thing is, math was this morning on Sparkling Start. <sighs> and phonics after math. Then play kind of. But on math, there was quite a lot of colouring to do. Colouring in that. But, supposed to be colouring it in like what the sum equals on each side. So, it, the answer on that side it was, and then the sum was on that side. And you need to put the same colour in each one. So it's like colouring, like side to side. But I did get a book, and it is somewhere over here. David Williams, billionaire boy. I am gonna. In short, Joe was only horrible, spoiled kid. He went on ridiculously posh school. He flew on private planes whenever he went on holiday once. He even had Disney World clothes for the day, just so he wouldn't have to queue for any rides. You two are playing really nicely. What are you playing? Last to leave the rug challenge. Last to leave the rug challenge, is that right? Yeah. What are the rules to this game then? So, it's the last one to leave the, the whole rug. You wins. It, it, you what, the last person or the last any, toy? Any of your body, including your, your trousers, if it goes up, it's all so thing that goes out. So that doesn't count because no, you need your whole body in cap no, out. No, you need your whole body. You, you just need one foot or your trousers to get out. Ah, oh, I see. You need to, yeah, they need to be super straight, don't they? Do a roll. Show me what rolls you've been doing at gymnastics. Can you can you do a roll and then go into standing up? <laughs> straight. That's better. Go like this. You need to be straight, don't they? So, um, yeah, you guys need a bath tonight, don't you? Uh, I have one yesterday. No, no you never. It's so bath night tonight. <laughs> But yes, I just wanted to, ow, oh, don't knock me. <laughs> I just wanted to pop on and say goodbye, really, and like end no! this video. Simba! Oh, what's he doing to your teddy? <laughs> Ooh. Want to play fetch? No. no, not with a teddy. No. <laughs> don't forget to hit the like button, don't forget to subscribe, and hit the notification bell to not miss a single video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.